Hey everybody, so as you can see, it's raining. Fucking hell! <laughs> and then he took off in that thing! Jesus! That's the... Jesus Christ! <laughs> That's fucking brilliant! Anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, it's raining, it's cold, and I've um, I finally reached my days off, so I was like, well, I've got to go for a ride. Yeah, that whole thing, my work reducing my hours, sir. Uh, Hasn't actually happened yet. I was talking about it on my Facebook. Oh yeah, loads of people have been coming over to my Facebook, my Twitter, recently. Um, I was kind of confused where it was all coming from. Look at the seagulls. They don't even want to fly today. I've got my visor open. I don't want that open. What's he selling? What are your wares? What are your goods, man? Sorry, gulls. He's selling fruit and veg in the end of a car park by the sea. Because that makes sense. Yeah, so my video making time is like limited at the moment and that really fucks me off because I've got quite a few plans and ideas, look this way, plans and ideas um, for things I want to do but I need time to do them and daylight and this time of the year it, it, it's dark when I go to work and it's dark when I get home. I got an early finish yesterday at four, I was like yes I've got to make a video, ah oh, fuck it's dark. At the moment I'm getting one or two questions very commonly, it's, I don't know whether it's this time of year people looking to get in bikes. But when people are asking me, what sort of 125 bike should I get? Uh, well, that, as I've talked about this so many times, is down to you. It's your needs, your budget, your experience, your knowledge in mechanics, blah, 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 blah. People have even sent me pictures of my own bike and said, well, not my own bike, but, you know, a sinister patch, and said, what do you think of this? I ride one. What more do you want me to say? <laughs> I've also been asked a few times lately to make a video on how to ride a bike, particularly a geared bike, because some people are saying, you know, they're, they're worried about the fact that they're having trouble with gears and... We'll see if the pigs are in the cold. Are you, where, are, where are you, piggies? Oh, there they are. Oh, look at them. Hello. Okay, and they're loving it in the mud. All right, you good? Yeah. Been up too much lately? Eating, wallowing your own shit. Yep. Anything else? Oh, and you're having another shit now, great. My God, fucking David Copperfield of pigs. And I've always thought, nah, there's no point in me making a how to ride a bike video because so many other people have done it. You know what I'm like, I'm like okay, get on the motorcycle. No, no, that's the wrong way. Okay, now to start the bike, you must first love it. I love you so much, please start for me, please. And the bike will start. Now the best thing to do is to engage fifth and then pull away. Yes, this is great. Make sure that all of your braking manoeuvres are in a sharp stabbing motion. Oh fuck! Oh god! And make sure that your clutch control is very indefinite and all over the place. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! But I realised that that would be a response. Holy shit! I didn't know dogs sounded like that. Oh my god, he's there! What do you want from me? What's that boy? He found another mine shaft? On a dildo? It's stuck in his ass. <gasps> That's terrible. Good. I, I feel like I've been told off. <laughs> yes, <laughs> what the fuck? It just goes to show that even on a shitty day like this, you can still go on your bike and have a good laugh. What the fuck? Um, could you? And lo, he parted the ducks as it was nothing. You know, Philip once bought me a boat. The car behind me wondered what the fuck I was doing as I drove my boat onto the poor peasants and commoners of the land, mincing them. But it was like, Philip, why are the boats out of the water? I don't understand, they can't go anywhere. And he said to me, Oh, I don't know what you're talking about, Bertha. I've had too much time being racist. Philip, I've drunk so much, I can't see where I'm going. I'm fucking wankered. No worries, Bertha. It's only the peasants of England, they're fine. There's plenty of them. <laughs> what the fuck am I talking about? Anyway, yeah, tomorrow I've got to go and see a neurologist. Yes, they're going to find out whether I actually am insane. 
Uh, no, seriously, there's. they've realised that actually 96% of my brain is missing. <laughs> Sorry, I'm joking. No, I'm not. Well, obviously I am. That's ridiculous. No one could survive with only 4% uh, of their brain remaining. Apart from me. But obviously it's quite handy because then I've got an awful lot of extra space up there to keep my keys, the phone, uh, some bits of chewing gum, some fluff. And a triple thick condom because, you know, you might get lucky, but you want to be safe. Well, oh, oh. oh, damn it. I've run out of fuel. Damn it, that was annoying. Well, there's only one option, I guess. English fire drill. Right, I've just had an idea. I've pissed in the tank because I'm pretty sure I pissed petrol. Seems that way. Oh, it's got a throaty mix. That piss got some poke. Of course I didn't run out of fuel. I'm not that stupid. I don't even have a fuel gauge and I've never run out of fuel. But it gets to be a good way of saying, have you heard Monty Python might be coming back? It's scary as hell. I'm really worried they're going to fuck things up. It's almost been too long, I fear, uh, for them to go back and touch that. I don't know. Right, okay, well, I'm going to go home, and I'm going to enjoy the rest of my day off in the dry. Thank you for not killing me, asshole! Um, oh, God, right. I think, I think I need to sleep more. I think I need to rest a bit. Um, because otherwise I'm just going to end up talking like this for, like, hours and, and screaming things like, Geraniums! At people. Chrysanthemums! <laughs> <laughs> what are you laughing at? It's not even funny! <laughs> For fuck's sake. Anyway, as you know, with me, when I'm not making videos, if you don't see so many out of me, it's just because I'm working loads. And as soon as I'm not, I make loads of loads. So, going to a bit of a quiet spot at the moment. But it will improve, or I will kill someone. I mean, how can an owl hold a spanner, really? I mean...